bleak Falls Barrow. It's a place where the line between the living and the dead blurs, and where only the brave or the foolhardy dare to tread. Villagers whisper of restless spirits and curses, and even the bravest hesitate to venture near. By day, it contrasts with Riverwood's beauty. By night, it becomes a dark sentinel, warning all to stay away. Nestled high in the mountains, bandits have decided to call it home, a cursed hideaway to store their ill-gotten gains. Theft, intimidation, murder. The order of the day. On a quest to retrieve a stolen dragon claw, our poor naive hero has no idea what awaits within. Will she overcome the ancient ruin, or will it, uh, well, ruin her? Having enlisted the help of Feindal, she might just about make it. Let's hope he can fight. Shit, what the hell, old man? What are you trying to do? Scare the shit out of me? As if I wasn't nervous enough? Jeez! I'm um, sorry. I was just trying to create a little drama. A little drama? Well, I think you may have gone a little too far. Did you just poo yourself a little too, Fred? I'm going to have nightmares for pissing weeks now. For fuck's sake, old man. I said I'm sorry, okay? I just wanted to get everyone pumped. I mean, it's Bleak Falls Barrow, damn it. Your first real challenge. Two sex. I have an additional attack thingy I can map. Might come in handy. You know seeing as I'm about to get demolished. There we go. Look, Willow, you needn't be afraid. Come on, Fred. And why's that old man? Well, I mean, you have the best armor anyone could ask for, for a start. Huh, really? You mean this crappy leather bikini? <laughs> No, I mean your, your, um, plot armor. Plot armor? What you talking about, old man? Well, you know. Don't you go ruining people's immersion now, you old git. I'll get through this based on my skill and my skill alone. Now piss off for a while, you've caused enough trouble already and we've barely even got started. I could do with a nap anyway. Sorry again, speak later. Yeah, bye. Okay, let's get the quest selected. Make sure I'm going the right way. Better try and limber up a bit. Get all loosey-goosey. Oh, can't wait to get something better than this shitty axe. Hand based on what the old man said, I'll definitely need something better than this. Fred, a wolf! takes care of that. You better step up, my dude. You're supposed to be leading this, Fred. I mean, it's your bloody girlfriend's claw. I'm really not that sure how helpful Fred is going to be. I mean, geez, he almost shot me back there with the wolf. Felt the arrow whistle past my nipple. As long as he can distract them, I guess that's good enough. Looks like some kind of tower up ahead. See some people walking around in the distance. Shit sake, old man. I'm proper freaked out now, damn you. Ugh. Forget about all that, Willow. You got this. Not too sure where Fred is off to exactly, though. Oi, Fred! I'm sure he'll catch up. He's probably just as nervous as I am, I guess. The old man has really given me the willies. That's what she said. Ah, get to fuck you. Piss off. <sighs> Those people up ahead must be the bandits Carol was talking about. Don't hesitate, Willow. These are bad folk. They deserve what they get. Oh, that's what she said. What a dickhead. Don't worry, Carol. We're going to get your fucking claw back. Even if it kills Fred. Right, you ready, my man? 
Yup, over here, Fred. This way. Jeez. No idea what Carol sees in him. Fred's a fucking moron. No offence, Fred. But you know it's true. All right then, Fred. Looks like one of them is leaning against the tree up there. You better have my back. Let's fucking go. Holy shit, what the hell am I doing? Fuck it. Don't think about it. Go rip them up, ghost. You can't... This is a surprise. That's it. Eat her face off, ghost. Taste my axe, bitch. Like that, did you? Want some more? Come on, Fred, help me, damn it. You're a fool to test me. Oh. Last ah. oh. You motherfucker. Nice shot, Fred. One down, now let's deal with this asshole. Come on then, you ugly fuck. Huh. Stay still, damn it. Missed. My turn. No. Get him, Fred. You Take him from behind. Pay for that. Awesome. Thanks, Fred. Good job. Yes, yes. You too, ghost. Ugh, my damn leg. You really stepped up there, Fred. I'm proud of you. I'm afraid I don't think that's the last of them, though, unfortunately. So be on your guard. Anything useful on you? Well, these boots are a little better than mine. Yoink! A steel mace. Oh, you shouldn't have. This hood might be warm, but it looks like shit. No thanks, buddy. Oh, look at his little toesies. Finally, a proper weapon. I mean, it isn't my first choice, but anything is better than that axe I was using. Better check the other two bodies, too. Might have some useful stuff on them. Iron armour, good protection, but too restrictive for me. I'll just take the Warhammer to sell in town. Oh, free food. Nice. Yes, finally got me a bow. Now we're talking. Oi, Fred. Help yourself to stuff, my man. These fools didn't stand a chance against us. You earned it. I know, I know. I should take the fur cloak. I just think it looks terrible. Ugh. Would rather just freeze my damn tits off. As you can tell, I'm a style over survival kind of girl. Don't judge me. Shut the fuck up, ghost! Stop judging me, damn you. Right, wh what's in here then? Oh, a little pouch of coins. Every little helps. Little bitch. Like, you're so damn perfect yourself, ghost. Anyway... I thought I'd feel a bit bad after killing for the first time, but I don't. Thought I would feel more guilt or regret. It just felt good. Felt right. Not really sure what that says about my mental state right now, but I have zero sympathy for those bandit scum. They fucked around and found out. Nobody messes with me. Oh, just some firewood. These bandits seem to have bugger all. Good amount of food, though. Can't complain too much, I guess. What's in here, then? Whoops! Petty soul gems. Awesome. Love carrying around dead people's souls in my pocket. Have to be honest, I was expecting a little more from this bandit hideout. Guess they aren't the best bandits if this is all they have. No wonder we took them out without too much trouble. They've got jack shit, Fred. Wouldn't bother wasting your time looking around the place. Right then, onto Bleak Falls Barrow. Really not looking forward to this. The old man's intro has really scared the crap out of me. I mean, as if it weren't already scary enough. Wonder what the hell is in there? Guess we'll find out soon enough. Should probably prepare myself, get some potions on standby. 
I have a feeling I'll need them. Right, come on, Fred! Keep up, Fred! Jeez, that place looks super creepy. Can't believe I'm even thinking about going in there. Bleak Falls Barrow discovered. Yay. Can't wait. Honest. All this for Carol's bloody claw. She better pay us well, damn it. You ready then, Fred? Oi, Fred, where you going? I'm scared too. Just try and focus on the beads you'll get from Carol as a reward. Now that's a good horny little elf. I knew the reminder of the potential beach from Carol would raise his spirits. The things you men would do for a beach, astonishing. Stay alert, Fred. I think we're being watched. Yep. A chance to test out my new bow. Sweet. Fuck. Way more of them than I thought there'd be. I'll just hang back here for a moment, take some pot shots. You're doing great, Fred! Just keep them busy! Ouch! Woo! Oh fuck, they're all coming for me! A little help, please, ghost. Fuck! How many of you are there? Ah! All of you to take on one little girl? Pathetic. Whoa, he jumped like a fucking salmon. Ah! Need to get some distance. Try to take them out one by one. That's more like it. Just me and you now, buddy. And her. Fuck. Shit, that was awesome. Huh. Ghost, I need you, dude. Ugh. Get the fuck off me. Help me, Ghost. This guy doesn't quit. Who's a good boy? Thanks, Ghost. I, I freaking love you. Oh, where did his body go? No idea. Can still loot him, though. All good, I guess. Now for the rest of them. Just keep standing there, my man. That's it? Pathetic. You okay, Fred? You all good? What you got on you then? Mmm. Some fine boots? A fine fucking war axe? Hell yeah! Come on, Fred! You won't leave there alive. Who you talking to, mate? You're the only one left now. Probably. Huh. Yeah. Huh. Are you crazy or something? Why aren't you fighting back? Yeah. Holy fuck. Wow. Split that guy right open on a backflip. Damn, I'm so fucking great. What you got on you then, dumbass? Meh. A shiny, shiny, lovely stuff. Wow, that felt good. What a rush. Think I might have bloodlust or something. I could get used to this. It's so damn satisfying, butchering bandits. Can feel my little heart pounding away. I feel so alive. Are you feeling slightly aroused too, Fred? No? Just me then, I guess.
ready yourself, Fred. I can see more of these bastards up ahead. Go get them, ghost. There's some of them. There. Get in there, Fred. Oh. Show them who's boss. Oh. Oh. That's it. Fuck them up, Fred. Oh. Shit, they're stabbing my boy up good and proper. Oh. Are you all right, Fred? Yeah, that's it, ghost. Oh. This guy is one tough son of a bitch. Ah oh, yes, Fred is back up. And down he goes again. Fuck! That's it, get the big kitty, ghost. But don't let him sell you any skooma. Yes, ghost! Great job! Actually, you know what? Better check his pockets for skooma just in case. Must have sold it all. Bikini top upgrade though, that'll do nicely. Cover your eyes, Fred. I'm changing my top. Fucking pervert! Better try and flank them. Let them concentrate on pervy Fred. Ah, oh, shit! A mage! Need to watch out for the lightning. That shit is scary. It. Rampage mode activated. Come here, you little bitch. Fuck's sake, Willow. Die! Suck it, mister. Jeez, that was close. Ah, oh, fuck, that hurts. Where the hell is Fred? Oh, there he is. Get up, Fred, damn it. Help me. Oh, fuck. Ah. Jeez, that never gets any better. Distract her ghost. This ends now. Sorry there, ghost. My bad. I got a bit too excited. Deepest apologies. Ooh, mage stuff. All those electric shocks were totally worth it. Just look at all this mage gear. Mm, yeah, better wait until we get back to Riverwood to put this on. You know, with Fred and his pervy ways and everything. It's far too sexy looking. Ew. No, thank you. That looked hideous. Definitely no skooma on him then, huh? Can't believe it. Well, Fred, we did it, buddy. At one point I didn't think you'd make it, but here you are, dude. You did great. So proud of that guy. What a battle that was. What a bloodbath. Calm down, Willow. You've not even made it inside yet. I dread to think what's waiting for us in there. Could be anything. The creepy ass looking place. That claw had better be in there, damn it. Ow! Oh, idiot. Um, roast horse haunch. Like as in actual horse. That's pretty messed up. Never say never, though. Desperate times and everything. We'll just clean this camp out and then head inside. It's freezing out here. Look, someone froze their nuts off. Do you get it, Fred? Fred, do you get it? Fine, ignore me then. Jeez, it wasn't that bad. No need to be a prick, Fred. He can be such an asshole sometimes. Gonna need a few of these after the day I've spent with Fred, I can tell you. Ah, 
Oh, is this one of those skill books where you read it and it gives you a skill in something? Ah, oh, I guess not. What a letdown. Mmm, more roast horse. Yummy. I think I just threw up in my mouth a little just thinking about eating that. Hold on, need some water. Eating horse for real? Blah! Think Fred is still annoyed at me for the joke, not sure where he is. Didn't really fancy heading inside alone. Oh no, you poor bugger. Wow, you rich poor bugger. Yeah, I know, that doesn't make sense. Shh. This guy was loaded, look at all this stuff. 525 coins, hell yeah. I don't think he'll be needing them. Thank you, frozen mister. Ah, oh, what am I doing? Just don't think about it, Willow. We'll be fine, hopefully. <laughs>